The world is becoming increasingly interconnected. With globalisation, trade and transport are occurring at unprecedented volumes. Goods and people are travelling farther and faster than ever before. Although these trends have boosted economic growth, they are not free of environmental and economic consequences. Research at Queen's University Belfast is addressing global environmental challenges arising from a range of human activities. Biological invasions have emerged as a major global environmental change. As the world has become more interconnected, we've been moving species farther, faster and in higher numbers than ever before. In the last 100 years, tens of thousands of non-native species have established globally. Some of these invading populations have severe impacts. Non-native species arrive in a variety of ways. Some can come unintentionally attached to ships on their hulls. Others can come through ballast water. Some can come through aircraft or even through cargo. Others are intentionally introduced as exotic pets, produce or ornamental plants. With a 35% increase in invasion rates expected in the next three decades, the scale of this problem will only rise. Research at Queen's, alongside our global collaborators, is at the forefront of achieving these targets. We are unravelling past and present patterns of biological invasions to better understand their drivers and improve future predictions. We are developing innovative management approaches to prevent biological invasions and control and eradicate the most damaging species on the ground. The global cost of biological invasions rivals that of earthquakes, storms and floods. Their economic costs run into the trillions of pounds and are quadrupling every decade. The most damaging invaders have cut yields in agriculture, forestry and fisheries. Others such as non-native mosquitoes have spread deadly human diseases, creating a healthcare cost. This is on top of the catastrophic environmental impacts that invasive species are causing. Islands such as the UK and Ireland are particularly susceptible to these impacts. Research led by Queen's has found that invasive species have cost the economy billions of pounds in the last five decades, largely due to species like the grey squirrel, zebra mussel and Japanese knotweed. The invasion problem must be addressed alongside other environmental challenges. The success and impacts of invasive species will be affected by future climate change. This perfect storm could see huge numbers of non-native species arriving in future and worsened impacts of those which are already here. Management delays are a big problem. Research at Queen's has found that there is not enough investment in preventative approaches such as biosecurity, early detection and rapid response. But there is hope. At Queen's we're developing new approaches to manage biological invasions and to predict which species will have high impacts in the future. However, now we need stronger international policy and more proactive management actions. Thank you.